Hello everyone, welcome to the Bug Expert channel. In this video, we will talk about solutions for friends who encounter Valorant DirectX runtime error. This error is due to the fact that the DirectX library is not available in the Windows operating system. For this, we can reach the solution of the problem by downloading the current DirectX library to the computer and performing the installation process. Before we show you solutions, we will briefly talk about the forum. You can forward various errors you encounter to the community on the forum portal we have opened. For this, if your problem continues or if you encounter a different problem, you can get a quick response by sharing it on the forum portal. We care about your questions and suggestions. This error, which is usually encountered, is due to the absence of the DirectX library. In addition, we recommend that you download the Windows Framework libraries and perform the installation process. For this, you can download the current libraries that we will leave in the article and perform the installation process on your computer. I am installing the DirectX library to the temporary file, that is, to the temp folder. After extracting the files to the temp folder, let's open the start search screen by typing temp and run the DirectX setup program and perform the installation process. After the installation process is complete, you can restart the computer and check if the problem persists. In such continuity problems, we may encounter an update error on the graphics card. For this, download the driver card in the article by reaching the link that matches your driver and check if your graphics card is up to date. Files in Windows are damaged or corrupted, which can cause various errors. For this, let's start the scanning process by pasting the code block in the article to the command prompt respectively. Let's type CMD in the start search screen and run it as administrator. Let's start the scanning process by pasting the code block in the article in the command prompt window, respectively. Do not shut down or restart your computer while the scan is in progress. This scanning process can take a long time. After all the processes are completed successfully, you can restart your computer and check if the problem persists. Yes, in this video we have provided information on how to fix Valorant DirectX runtime error. If you are encountering various errors, you can reach the community with your questions by accessing the forum portal we have opened. By supporting us, we can expand our community. Thank you.